Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to replace the tail light in this Sterling trailer. I think it's the, I got it at the Home Depot originally. Uh, I'm going to replace uh, this broken light here with uh, this one here I picked up at uh, Napa Auto Parts. So the light is just stuck inside of this rubber grommet. And it's just a matter of wheeling it out. Like so. And compare it to the one that I got. Make sure it's the right size. Yeah, it looks good. So I'm just going to uh, get this cleaned up. So now I'm just going to remove this light. Just unplug it from there. And With a new one, and you'll see that there's some grease down here that will help the connections last longer. And then I'm just gonna slide it right in. Here we go, it's lined up. It's a bit of an awkward setup, but once you get it in, you feel that the connectors go right in solid. They're not down the side yet. There we go, you can feel it just fits in snug. There we go. And then I'll put the grommet back on. And then we attach the grommet right in here. So that the grommet is uh, snugly in place, just need to take the light and then just squeeze that back in. Make sure it goes in evenly. There we go, so it makes the salt fit. The only thing now is just to test it, make sure it's all good. So to do the test, I put the hazard lights on, the four-way flashers. Okay, that works. Next I'll try the uh, park lights, which will be the lights that are on when it's running. So to test that, I just put the park lights on. And there we go. So that's how you change the uh, lights, the tail lights, in the uh, Sterling aluminum trailer. Thanks for watching.